LG makes installing your window air conditioner in your home quick and easy. In this video, we will demonstrate how to properly install and set up your LG window air conditioner. Please keep in mind that the air conditioner unit is heavy. Two or more people are required for safe installation. Failure to do so could result in injuries. This room air conditioner is designed for insulation in standard double hung windows with actual opening widths from 22 to 35 inches and a vertical opening of 13 inches. Do not install through the wall, vertically, or in direct sunlight. Your window insulation kit should include an assortment of 11 type A and 5 type B screws, 3 L brackets, 1 adhesive seal strip, 1 seal, 2 guide panels, one support bracket, and a drain joint pipe and drain washer. You will also need the following tools for installation. A screwdriver, scissors, pencil, ruler, hammer, and a level. Insert the guide panels into the guides of the air conditioner. Fasten the curtains to the unit with four type A screws on each side. Cut the seal strip to the window width, removing the backing, and attach the seal strip to the underside of the window. Some windows may require you to install a wood strip in the center of the sill to raise the L bracket, making the sill flush against the back of the inner sill. Measure and mark the center line of the inner sill. Next, measure and mark another line 8 inches above and below that center line. This is where your two L brackets will be placed. Install two L brackets behind the inner window sill, centered on the lines drawn above and below the center line with the short side of the bracket as shown. Make sure that the bracket edge is flush against the back of the inner sill and use type A screws to secure. Carefully set the AC in the window so that it is centered and place the AC so that the front edge of the bottom guide is against the back edge of the sill. While studying the AC, bring the window sash down behind the upper guide of the AC unit. The air conditioner should tilt slightly downward at the back if it is set up properly. This ensures proper drainage. Extend the guide panels to fill the window opening and secure them using four Type B screws, two on the top and two on the bottom. Cut the seal to the window width and stuff the sash between the glass and the window to prevent air and insects from getting into the room. Fasten the L bracket using a type A screw. Remove the screw from the right side of the AC cabinet. Fasten the support bracket using the screw removed from the cabinet and attach the support bracket to the inner window sill with a type B screw. Welcome to the Medea U-shaped air conditioner installation video. Today we'll go through the installation process of your Medea U-shaped air conditioner and bracket. Upon opening the box, you will find the new Medea U-shaped window air conditioner along with one main bracket, one short and one long right extension arm, two main support pins, two cotter pins, side arm foam, quarter inch type B screws, half inch type B screws, half inch type A screws, one inch type A screws, window sash lock, one right and left open window bracket, and various foams for sealing. The tools needed are a Phillips head screwdriver, a level, tape measure, pencil or marker, scissors or knife to cut the foam, and a drill with an eighth inch drill bit. You may also need a flathead screwdriver. Before you begin, measure the dimension of your window and window track to determine how your Medea U-shaped air conditioner will need to be set up. First, 
Verify the angled support arms are correctly inserted in the main support channels. The small tabs on the side must sit inside the channel. Next, set your main bracket on a flat surface, such as a table, and adjust the left extension arm out to the left side of the bracket. Based on your window measurement, insert the included right extension arm. The long right extension arm is for 26 inch to 36 inch windows, and the short right extension arm is for 22 inch to 26 inch windows. For windows that require the front of the bracket to sit on the window sill, adjust the extension arms to your window sill width. If necessary, rotate your anti-tip bracket to fit your window track. Window tracks half inch or less will need to use the narrow end of the anti-tip bracket. With the bracket assembled, install it into the window frame by placing the main support arms out of the window and letting the angled support arms hang down. Lower the bracket and place the front of the bracket on the inside of the window frame. If your bracket sits on the window sill, maintain control of the bracket and then secure the bracket to the window now. Move the angled support arms in until the feet touch the outside of the building. Then place a level on the main supports here or here. Adjust the first angled support arm so the bracket is tilted downward toward the outside. The level should show one quarter bubble for the correct angle. With the first angled support arm set at the correct angle, Install the support pin through the closest matching hole along the main support and insert the cotter pin. Using the numbers on the main support, adjust the second angled support arm to match the first. Insert the main support pin and cotter pin. Double check the level and make any necessary adjustments. Next, center the bracket with the center of the window. Notice that the main supports are not centered on the horizontal bracket so be sure to center the bracket using the right side of the tab. Once centered, slide out the left and right extension arms until they touch the side of the window frame. Secure the extension arms to the side of the window frame by pre-drilling and fastening the extension arms through the holes provided on the end or bottom. Before installing the air conditioner, double check that you have the proper orientation of the anti-tip brackets. With the window fully opened, place the Medea U-shaped air conditioner on the support bracket, ensuring the channels on the bottom of the air conditioner align with the bracket. While keeping a hand on the air conditioner, partially close the window into the U-shaped slot to help align the unit with the window. Next, install the left and right open window brackets using the provided Type B screws. For installations where the bracket sits on the windowsill, use the provided 1 inch type A screw to secure the bracket to your windowsill. Now fold down both sidearm hinges and measure the distance between the hinge and window frame. The foam can be custom cut to form fit your window frame if desired. Add 1 quarter inch to the measurement and cut the sidearm foam to length. Install the foam between the sidearm hinge and the window frame. With the foam in place, slide the anti-tip brackets out and insert them into the window track. These must be installed. With the arms fully extended and in the tracks, secure the anti-tip brackets by reinstalling the provided Phillips screw. You can now fully close the window. Extend the integrated window locks out until they touch the window. You can also install the optional window sash lock for added security. Finally, install the window sash seal. Check for any gaps and use the provided foam pieces to seal any openings between the air conditioner and the window. Plug in your Medea U-shaped window air conditioner and enjoy. The window unit is now fully installed and ready for use.
Winter portable air conditioners offer mobile and convenient cooling solutions anywhere you need it. With an easy setup and powerful cooling, Winter portable air conditioners provide a convenient way to stay cool and comfortable. The Winter ARC 14S 14,000 BTU portable air conditioner is a highly effective dual hose unit that provides exceptionally effective cooling when you need it most. Utilizing a dual hose system, this unit is able to more efficiently cool and maintain the conditions within a room. This portable air conditioner comes in two versions, the ARC 14S, which is a cool only unit, and the ARC 14SH, which has a heat pump function that can be used as a space heater during cooler weather. For the portable air conditioner to cool effectively, the hot air the unit removes from the room needs to be vented to the outside. The window venting kits that come with our winter portable air conditioner fits most standard windows. You may make a custom modification and vent the exhaust through a wall or into a drop ceiling. Lift the window and adjust the window slide bars to the width or height of your window. Next, tighten the screws to hold the slide bars in position. Make sure the grooved side of the window slide bar is facing inside. Insert the fixtures to the holes of the window slide bar. Make sure the two closure tabs of the fixture are facing the inside. Install the four screws of the fixture from the inside. The end of the screw should point towards the outside. Close the window tightly enough to hold the slide bar in place. Attach the hose connectors to both ends of the hoses. Attach one end of the hoses to the back of the air conditioner. Extend the hoses as needed and attach the other end to the window slide bar. The easy setup process is complete. You can now enjoy your winter portable air conditioner. Pull open the top air vent. Power on the unit using the control panel. Select cool mode by pressing the mode button. Set desired temperature by pressing the plus and minus buttons. Select fan speed by pressing the fan button. This unit comes equipped with a pre-filter as well as an odor neutralizing carbon filter.